Mark here on the Culinary Compass in Austin, Texas. Post five tequila shots. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, Avi Hartman. Avi. Yeah. Avi. Avi. And I am. Uh, Have you wait, wait, wait? No more. Javi, yeah. Javi, have you yet to cast off the the yoke of Moses, or are you still plying your as you sell your pork products? Are you still plying your well your you Yiddish tell, your Yiddish roots? You can probably tell by the tattoos on my arm that I'm not Shomer Shabbos. Okay. And the grin on my face. Javi is serving up a whole bunch of non-kosher products. Tell me about the choices you've made for your particular pork products. Well, um, believe it or not, uh, I think uh, a lot of people might be surprised to find out that uh, a hot dog stand takes their food seriously, but we really do. In fact, uh, yes, you do. All of these recipes have been carefully chosen by us. Well, let's just take a quick look here at that little sucker. Of an almost disappeared jalapeno this sausage. This is the jalapeno. Yeah. Well, it's pure pork. Yeah, and it's made by Texas Sausage Company. Oh, God. And uh, they're local guys. They're right down the street from us. Is this a custom sausage you're serving? Well, the, uh, there's two in particular. The, uh, uh, the bratwurst. Could you point them out? Please? Yeah, this is our bratwurst. Uh, it's also made locally. And this is our Italian sausage. And both of those are proprietary to the best worst. Although this one has actually started to spread. Other people are now selling our bratwurst. But oh, my goodness. The Italian belongs to us. That now, is our I sausage. A, I didn't have the Italian. That's the next the one bratwurst. I'm handing to you. Okay. Yeah. I didn't have either of those. I had the other one, which is also pure pork. So what is this, just lacking well, any the, fennel? The, the jalapeno is smoked jalapeno chilies, uh, pork, and beef hearts. Okay. Okay. And beef yeah, hearts. Yeah. I'm going to give it to you one half the way I get it on some days and the other half the way I get it on the other days. All right. So one half is with ketchup. With curry ketchup. Curry ketchup. Yeah. So uh, obviously uh, caramelized onions all over the place. Um, that sweet onion to you know, work, work with the fennel and everything. And then we got some ketchup on one side uh, to add a little sweetness. Let's see what we got. We're gonna start with the ketchup side. All right. This guy's the biggest smart ass as I am. Huh. That's freaking awesome. That is really good, but you know what, Avi? Foodie to foodie? Yeah. Gotta kick the fennel up. I love it too, but I like it as a touch. Too much and this it is starts so... to turn into Jägermeister on a bun, you know what I mean? Jägermeister on a bun. How many days a week do you eat sausage? <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my god. Well, out of all of them, I. For me, really good. That's the, I, all, I love all of them, but that's the one sausage that I can eat completely unadulterated by itself and be satisfied. I think it's just, it's actually oh my perfect. God. That one to me oh is perfect. Oh my God. And that one belongs completely to us. It's the only place on the planet you can get that. That's freaking amazing. That's an amazing sausage. It's, it really is awesome. All right, so, Avi, thank you very much. Absolutely. For your time. For the Culinary Compass. Ciao for now.